Hey everyone, we're doing seven reviews in about seven days. I actually missed a day, so it's not going to be seven and seven anymore. But you know what? We're cruising along anyway. I will get seven in a row done. Today we're going to be doing Bubble Us. Bubble Us is a web-based mind mapping program, and we're going to get right into it. Let's do it! Hey everyone, thanks for joining me. Now, I want to get right into this because I know my last couple of reviews have been pretty long. I'm going to try and keep things toned down a little bit in this review. I want to talk about a couple of things here. This is Bubble Us. You can go, it's, it's one of the, it's, it's a domain hack. It's B-U-B-B-L dot U-S, Bubble dot Us. And I want to just get into this here, some of the details. I'll throw some of the, the links down below to how you can get there. It's completely free if you want. Now, it's is and it isn't. There, it's free if you only want to have up to three mind maps. That's a little bit limiting, but it's not the end of the world. It's purely online, and if you want, you can just sign in, or you can just start using the thing. If you want to get in and have more maps, it's 6 bucks a month or 59 a year. So consider that when you're making a decision on this. I want to get into and talk about what I like about this. I like the fact that you can left click and you can just drag the menu, the, the map around. I like that you can expand and contract it or you zoom in and zoom out using the scroll mouse. There's also a fit button which helps you get things sized up nicely. So you can check out a couple of things just to get the, the right zoom if you, if you think you're having some, some issues there. I also like the fact that when it's collapsed, here, let me just collapse what I like. It's a little hard to see, but I'll maybe zoom in. You can see there's a number there and that tells you how many nodes, how many child bubbles, they call it, are below that. You can also collapse everything to maximize the page. So overall, it, it's a pretty good system solution for just being a, a quick and quick and easy uh, online solution. A um, couple of things that I'm maybe not a fan of of this is one is you've got to hover over stuff to get it to work. So I can't go in and start making things work. I'm and for me, I'm sure like a lot of people, you get kind of jumpy. You got to sit there, hover until this pops up. And then I can delete it or change the color or do or, or move it. So I can grab it and I can move it around and do you know, different tasks. Uh, that was a little bit annoying for me. It was just having to ugh, there sit there and hover for that. That one second is just it seems like it's a it's a long time for me to wait. I also I'm not a huge fan that it, like I said here it doesn't it doesn't auto resize when I add a new note. So I can go in, I can add something new, and I can add whatever, but. It just leaves everything exactly as it is. It's just, it's not moving things around. It's, everything's kind of stationary. And that to me, I, I wish it could sort of auto move and adjust to make sure that everything fits on the screen or that it scrolls nicely around the node, whatever else it is. I also, this 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 does freak me out too, that I have to click off the bubble. I, I don't understand this, where I'm here, I'll hit enter. I'm like, oh, no, 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 no not enter. Okay, uh, I got to, oh, oh, wait a second. I've got to click off of it. So that it just stops that cursor from flashing. For me, that's just a big deal. I don't see Bubble Us as being a, a huge, it's not really going to be a complete comparison to some of the other programs that I've been showing you. What I see it as is a, a quick and dirty thing. You can get in here, you can use it. It's simple to use, it looks decent, it's got portability because as long as wherever you're going has internet access, you should be able to get hold of your mind map. So it, there are certainly options there. Uh, overall, though, looking at uh, looking at Bubble Us, I like the fact that it is simple to use. It's intuitive, except for that part where I've got a I can't hit enter to close a node because that I don't understand that. It's also free for up to three maps. I think definitely if you're looking at just a, a simple thing where you don't want to download anything on the computer and install anything on the computer, this might be an option. There are also sharing options. I'll just show you the sharing quickly. So it it does make it easy to make a quick mind map and then go ahead and start sharing it. There's a drop down link here you, where you can either have a read only or you can have an HTML embed. So you can you can share these things very very simply. Do it up, embed the stuff, chuck it onto a website, and have a sweet looking mind map on your site. I don't want to compare this to some of the installed programs that we've been looking at because this is definitely not as robust as some of those. But it's a nice little feature. So there you go. Bubble.us. Bubble.us. Bubble us. All right. And that's it. Bubble us. Let me know what you think. Is there something I missed? Leave me a comment down below. Let me know what's good, what's bad. And we'll, we're going to keep moving forward. This is, again, day four of a seven-day challenge. Trying to do seven, seven reviews of mind mapping programs in approximately seven days.